Welcome back everybody. This is Joyce and Lena and we are back playing Siberia. Now as we left off last time, uh, I think the determination based on the only thing I have is the pencil and paper is that basically all I have left, whoops, that would not be where I wanted to go. Uh, basically the next thing I want to do is talk to Momo and draw him a picture. So I am hoping that if I go find Momo, um, he's in the attic at Anna's house, that once I get there, I'm going to try to talk to him or do something so that we can figure out how to draw him a picture. So rather than watching Kate walk, uh, we will come back once we get back to Anna's house. Okay, we are back here in the attic, and I'm at a loss. Um, I'm assuming somewhere in here, like here's some pictures of stuff, but you know, I can't go back here. This is as far as I can go. I can't even click on the desk anymore, which I think I tried last time uh, before or the last time I was up here. The only thing I can think of is there's got to be something in the room where Momo scared me half to death in the first place. So I had come in here, turned on the light and then the footsteps. So that kind of scared me. I'm like, ooh. Um, and since then, I've not been able to find anything out. What's this? Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Hans, I can draw a mammal, mammoth just like Hans. Um, okay. Well, you know, that's why we come and look and look and look. Pencil and paper. Take a look. Ta-da! So I'm not drawing anything. We're just going to do a, a quick uh, scrub. There we go. That hopefully will do. That's the best I can do. Although, I mean, Kate should have tried. I mean, she might have been able to really try. Couldn't have been that, that hard to draw a mammoth. Has she ever played Pictionary? A stick figure would be fine. Okay, so now... Momo, I've got something else I want to ask you. Um, Momo listening. Am I asking? Or do I need to pull it out again? I think I do. I think I Momo, do. Sorry. I've got to go now. But see you later, maybe. Yeah, I'm actually not going to go anywhere. I'm just going to... Wait. Where'd it go? So did I need Momo, to... Is it somewhere on I've here? Got is it under mission? I want to ask you. Momo listening. Cave, Anna, Automaton, Momo, Train, Hans, Help, Mission. You're a sweet kid, Momo, but I can't draw. Least of all, mammoths. Draw mammoth easy. Hans draw mammoth. Anna draw mammoth. Kate, too. I mean, maybe I could do a quick squiggle of a... No. <sighs> My goodness. Okay. I don't get it. Momo? I've... I don't get it. I, ju I did it. I did. It's nowhere in my inventory. Do I have to do it this way? Oh. Oh, game. Oh, game. Oh, game. User error continues. Oh. What'd I do? I clicked the wrong thing. Here. Grab. Give. Oh, my goodness. Apparently he's excited. Mm, thank you. Momo happy. Now follow Momo. Momo show his secret to Kate. Okay, well. That sounds a little suspicious. Okay, off to that way. Here we go. Well, I wonder if we're going to the other side of the house now. There was nothing over there, like, 15,000 episodes ago when we were there. Because I'm assuming Momo doesn't have a key to the front door.
Nope, still locked. The door's locked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I, I want to continue around the house, Kate Walker. Do I have to go back to go forward? I have to go back to go forward. Wait a second. How do I, how do I get out of here? Well then where did Momo go? Did he go into the maze? Oh, there he is. Okay, down the street. Out we go. Okay, so we're going down that way. Momo, come back! Kate, can you run? Oh, you can! A double click? Oh. Are you kidding me? All this time? How many episodes? She could have been running? Conk. I'm conking my head. It's no longer the Kate Walker walking simulator. Momo, I don't see you. I'm supposing you continued down the street. Oh, wait. What about here? This gate back here? There you are. You have a way in through the back gate. But how does that lead all the way over to Anna's place? I don't get it. Like that's even on the opposite side of the street. Okay. Stairs. Okay, we gotta check to see if there's anything. So obviously up those stairs, but is there anything else we should be looking at? No, I wonder if other people would sit here at some other time if we'll be back to this spot. To have a conversation with somebody. This is a very forested area. I did not expect that. I wonder, does this lead to the cave? It must. Because it's like way out in the woods. Which then means Momo's seen the cave, seen the mammoths. Oh. An ore. It's a shame this boat's been left to rot. Now it's full of holes. I'm gonna have to fix a boat. I'm gonna have to fix bo a boat, people, once I find Momo again. Because fixing a train, fixing a robot was not enough. Okay, he's gonna sit and relax. Let's go talk to him now. <sighs> there you are, Momo. This is some walk you've taken me on. I've got to say, though, it sure is mighty pretty. Momo come here often. Momo like make splash in water. Okay. Um. Cave? So you reckon the cave that Hans and Anna found is round here? You wouldn't know where it is exactly, would you? Cave disappear. Anna say nobody find it. Disappear. Like magic. Caves don't go disappearing like that. It must be hidden by something. That's all. Momo like playing hide and seek. I think that's just as well. Okay, so next. Why have you brought me here? Mammoth doll in cave. Very important for hands, Anna say. Cave? What cave? Where? Momo, not liar. We already talked about the cave. 
cave, Kate. Right. Now we're here. What do we do? Kate and Momo throw stones in water. Momo, we're here because of the cave. Something to do with the cave. Momo and Kate, friends. See, you draw somebody a mammoth and then they're Tell friends. Me, Momo, do you really think that after... Anna always say hands go away, but hands come back, maybe. Okay. Momo, so, I've got to go now. We're but supposed see to you later, throw maybe. stones. Where are we going to find stones? Over here? Over by the water. Come on, Momo! We're going to throw stones. Uh, I don't see any stones. I see a pathway. And it, Am I going to walk across? No, she doesn't want to get her shoes wet. Come on, Katie. It's not even that deep. You could probably jump that. Ah, uh, could see. I can't go that way. Yeah, that looks like a cave to me. Okay, so clearly, up the steps. Fine, Momo. You sit there. You're just a young lad. I don't want you to get work up a sweat, you know. Because, you know, kids aren't prone to play and stuff like that. Here, let, let me do all the work. Okay, so apparently this will let the water, if I can move it. Watch, it won't budge. Ah, it must be broken. I've got to get a helping hand here. I know, how about Momo? It must be broken. I've got to get a helping okay. hand here. So, where can we go next? Can we ask Momo to help us with this? I wonder. Hey, Momo, you want to help? Help an old lady out? Momo, I've got something else I want to ask you. Momo, listening. You got any muscles in there? Because I could sure use them. Why have you brought me here? Oh. Mama's cave. Momo, not... Clearly, no help. Can you help me, please? What do? Oh, okay. Help me open the dam. Um, Momo's strong. That's what I was hoping for. Up here. I tried pushing, didn't work. Maybe you could. Well, that's a no. Oops. Oops. That's all you gotta say is oops. Uh, so I'll pick this up. Can I stick it in? There's another hole. Can I? It's amazing what she can fit in there. Okay, broken lever. No. I cannot put the broken lever in there. Can I use the broken lever as a way of crossing over to the cave? I'm gonna I'm gonna guess no. Cause that's how I would solve the puzzle. If it was Joyce and Lena doing the work here, we'd be sticking the broken lever and like crossing over, like put it right there. And then you could cross over and like walk across it. Okay, no. He gives me an oops. Oops. Oh well. Can I pick you up? Can I pick you up? No, I can put down the lever and do what? I'll use the lever to get the ore. Ugh, that ore is all dirty and wet. Yeah. You won't pick Ugh, it up? That ore is all dirty and wet. It's dr you won't pick it up because it's dirty and wet. I'm, I'm at a lot. I'm at a loss. Do you want Moa to pick it up because he won't mind getting it all grimy? That's all I can imagine. Oh, I forgot. Run! Run, Kate! Run! Okay, now will you help me? Because I don't want to get my hands dirty. I'm wearing a mm. kind of white jacket. I have Momo listening. And if I touch that thing... I've moved the ore nearer. Be a good boy and carry it for me. Momo say yes. 
Well, you know, that's kind of what parents do. Like, ooh, this is yucky. Hey, kid, come over here. Pick this up, will you? Okay. See, he doesn't care. Kate, what? why don't you just pick it up? Nice ore. It's fine. Since we're not going to use the boat, since it has holes in it, we'll use the ore. Well, okay, I guess he's taking it with him. We'll use the ore as a new lever, right? Okay, off we go. So do I ask him about the ore? Momo. Momo. Yeah. Um, mission. Why have you brought me no. Mama Cave? Momo. Help. Can you help me, please? What do? I need a hand opening the dam. Momo say yes. Momo strong. Yeah, you're so strong. You broke the last lever. Can we not break the ore? Okay. See, it seems he's smart enough. He knows what to do. Okay. Aha. So that will lower mm -hmm. the water. Momo very strong. And we Thank can get you, across Mama. the path. Okay, so across the path, so pretentious Kate doesn't get her shoes wet. I mean, they're boots. They go all the way up past to the middle of her calf. She could have crossed that, no problem. Looks like Momo already did. Okay, and around we go, over to the cave. In we go. Okay, so what do we get to look at here? I guess there's nothing to click on and there's nothing to pick up. But we'll be headed towards the rock. Oh, it's not even on the rock anymore. There's the doll. Okay, anything else? No. So we can go back. And that was it. And we're and we're out of here. I keep forgetting. Run, Kate, run. I'm surprised the game didn't have her remark about the mammoth drawings would have been interesting to see her reaction but instead she's like I'm on a mission I'm getting the heck out of here I gotta get back to my jerk boyfriend hello Kate is it you well yeah who did you think it was uh, I didn't recognize your voice that's all must be the distance or something so spill the beans what's your up like you lucky lady you honestly I never get that kind of break well, so far all I've seen of Europe is this tiny village, and frankly, they're not very hospitable. Oh, the whole case is getting really complicated. There's this surprise heir I've got to find. I know. I talked to Lynn who bumped into Joss and she had coffee with the head honcho this morning. He didn't sound at all happy. The client's meeting him tomorrow, and when Marston tells him that the sale's not even gone through yet, whoa, you're going to be pleased you're on the other side of the ocean when that bomb goes off. Yeah, I get the picture. But so, how about yourself? What's up at work? We lost the fair Lou trial. I worked five months on that dumb case. I remember. So, for a bit of therapy, I went to Boomies. The sale started yesterday. Wow, lucky. It was absolutely crazy, Katie. Absolute mayhem. You know that blue silk top I wanted? Guess how much I got it for. I don't know. 250? 200? 
$140. Just get yourself back here and I'll go down with you. Like it's my choice. Look, I gotta go. Call me soon, huh? I want a blow-by-blow -blow account of every moment of your great adventure. Get out of here. Look after yourself. You too. Yeah, I will. Now, back in 19... Well, not 19. What was it? 2003? Is that when we said this first came out? Back in 2003, an international phone call to talk about a sale at Bloomingsdale would have cost you a fortune. That probably would have been a $40 call right there. So I can't imagine that her friend's just going, Yeah! Hey, I went to this uh, sale at Bloomingdale's. You'll never guess what a deal I got on a blue silk blouse. I don't know. Maybe they have different priorities. Maybe that's what it's trying to show, is that you know Kate's surrounded by really shallow people. And that this trip, I don't know, is especially when she said that the townspeople were inhospitable. I mean, they're closed down for a funeral of kind of the matriarch of the town. I don't know that that's inhospitable. I think that's just, you know, they're observing a day of basically silence in honor of her. So I don't know. Maybe this will be a life-changing experience for Kate, and, and she's got some growing to do. Okay. So I take it I need to give Momo the doll. Like, I would have thought that he would have stuck around and just picked it up himself, but... You know... He ran off? I'm hoping he ran, but I, I have no idea where he ran, actually. I'm just running back to Anna's house, hoping that he's there. Bye, Mr. Patisserie guy. I'm sorry I called you inhospitable. Okay. I still gotta get in this double click mode to get Kate to run. She didn't want to run in the first six episodes because, you know, those aren't the best, most comfortable shoes. I'm sure that must be it. Okay. Please tell me Momo's back up in the attic. Watch, he's probably at the hotel. Or maybe at Anna's grave. Those are the other possibilities. No, he's not here. Okay, well, I'll come back to you when I've found him. Okay, well, I have been everywhere, and I've not been able to find Momo, so one of the things I was thinking is that perhaps he is going to be on the train wanting to come with me wherever I'm going. So let's check over by the train. I mean, I've been to the hotel, I've been to the cemetery, I've been... Um, back to the attic and he is nowhere to be found so this is my last best hope let's see what we do here okay there's Oscar is Momo anywhere in here not in there not in there uh Oh, my bags. No point weighing myself down. Oh, fine. Then why did you let me go for it? So, no, there's no Momo here. Um, well, you know, the one thing we do have is we can give Oscar the ticket and see what happens. Or the whatever thing that we had to have stamped. Come on. Okay. What do I have in here? Oh, no. Wrong button. Uh, return again. Um, this thing. The train release permit. Okay, let's give that to Oscar. Oh, thank you for standing out of the camera angle Here. there, Kate. This is your stupid train release ratification, Oscar. 
Thank you, Kate Walker. That is perfect. Now who's being inhospitable? So he accepted that. Was that it? Do we not need the Momo? Are we keeping the Mammoth doll? Okie dokie. Here's the train ticket. Let's go. There you are, Oscar. Does this mean we can leave now? I cannot accept this ticket for the moment, Kate Walker. Keep it. Hmm. I don't understand why we can't leave. I'd hate to think it's me that's delaying the train like this. I do not wish to appear impolite, Kate Walker, but I am afraid that not all departure conditions have been fulfilled. Huh. If what? that's a joke, Oscar, it's not very funny. What I conditions? really need to find Hans Vorlberg as quickly as possible. I have strict instructions to obey. There are three spaces in the luggage compartment that are designed to accommodate two very important objects. The train can only depart when they are in place. Please excuse me now. I must return to my departure preparations. Oh, I wouldn't want to break any rules. Three spaces that require two important objects? How do you do that? Wouldn't you need three important objects for three spaces? So that's one. Well, so is the mammoth an important object? Maybe it goes here. Oh, look. Look, it goes here. There we go. So when I have all the voice little thingies, do I have all of them? I think I only have two. I only have two out of four. So maybe what he was saying is that the other two needed to be fulfilled, but this didn't need to be completely fulfilled? Oh, I never noticed. This one's blue on top, and this one's green on top. Interesting. I wonder if we'll have red and purple like the colors of the um, priest robes. Okay. So now will you take my ticket? Ticket? Here. There you are, Oscar. Does this mean we can leave now? I cannot accept this ticket for the moment, Kate Walker. Keep it. I don't understand why you're still refusing to take this ticket. Everything is in order, and an engineer prides himself. On punctuality. Yes, Oscar, I remember. But what now? Yes, but what now? what's up, Oscar? Why haven't you returned to your engine room? If I may be so bold as to express a personal opinion on this matter, Kate Walker? <sighs> I'm all ears, Oscar. I fear we have omitted to wind up the locomotive springs. Is that all? Then let's do oh, it for Christ's sake. Remember we did that a long time ago. I'm afraid I have no notion of how to implement this function, Kate Walker. It would seem that the makeshift completion of my production process is responsible for a lack of instruction on this matter. Hmm. Okay, right. I'll see to that myself then. I mean, a wind-up train can't be that complicated. You wait there. I won't be long. Thank you, Kate Walker. Okay, so that's just on the other side of the train. So back when we first kind of evaluated the train station and we clicked a bunch of stuff, I think we saw this already. It's like over here. By the guy whistling Dixie. I don't know where he's at, but he's whistling somewhere. Doing lots of sweeping. He does a good job. It's nice and neat. I don't see any garbage in the garbage bins. Okay, so there's a crank. So if I remember, this thing comes flying out, does, and it goes in there, right? And it didn't go all the way. Oh, is, it, is that what this is for? Oh, there you go. Opens the door. Oh, see, I didn't even have to crank it anymore. Oh, well, we better crank it back, because Oscar probably won't leave if it's sticking out like that. Okay, so is this it? Is this the final we can get moving? Let's go find Hans Vorlberg. Maybe Momo's not coming with us, so that was all I need of Momo. Okay. See ya, Momo! I'll try to bring Hans back. Uh oh, phone call. Kate, it's me again. Oh, it's Dan. Dan. I was gonna call you. Yeah, yeah. Are you mad at me? 
I've just called Martha and Lorma. They told me you weren't expected to return this week. Oh, yeah. So when are you coming home? I don't know. There's nothing I can do about it. The situation is kind of tricky, you know. At the beginning of next week, I hope. Yeah, whenever. Dan, please. Just hang in there, okay? The stakes are higher than I thought, and you know how much I love this job. I suppose it's neither here nor anywhere to you that the Goldbergs are going to... It is. I mean, it isn't. I mean, Dan, this really isn't the moment. You know I'm thinking about you. I love you, sweetheart, and I'll give you a call when I have some news. I promise. I've got to go now. I've got kind of a, a train to catch. A train? Where are you off to now? This is crazy, Kate. To tell you the truth, I've no idea. Love you, honey. You know that. Kate! Oh, I I have so many comments in my head. I'll I'll keep them to myself, maybe. But really, she is doing her own job. She can't do your job if you can't handle the girl the Goldberg account. Then maybe you don't deserve to have it. So that's about all I can say. But yeah, here, take my ticket. I just got off the phone with my boyfriend, who's driving me crazy. I just need to get going. He took it. <gasps> Rest. Could Everything be it? is in order then. The train is finally ready to leave. I am most terribly embarrassed. Such ignorance on my part is uh, inadmissible. No? What? I hope you still have confidence in my abilities, Kate Walker. Please return to your seat and we can leave. Yes! Finally. Yoohoo! Which seat? There's lots of seats. I don't have to have a particular one, right? I can just sit wherever. And here we go! Well, I think that's enough for today. I hope you enjoyed this lengthy episode of Siberia. And uh, we will see where we ended up. So I can't wait until then. We will see you next time. Mm -hmm.